Hi, this is Karen from the Mojo Radio Show. Welcome. Today, we have Clarence from the Infinity Media Group here to talk to us about how he helps his clients get seen, noticed, and how he helps you turn prospects into strong leads. Welcome to the show, Clarence. Thank you so much, Karen. It's a pleasure to be here with you. Well, it is really a pleasure to be here with you too, because I can tell our listeners that not only are, is Clarence knowledgeable, he has an IT background, and he is a really great person to talk to. Thank so you. I Thank you so much. You <laughs> I know people will really enjoy talking to you. So Clarence, tell us a little bit about your business. Well, Karen, my business is called Infinity Media Group. We are based in Woodbridge, Virginia, just outside of Washington, D.C. And we are a full service consulting and marketing agency. And we help business generate consistent and predictable revenue through automated online and offline processes. And you know what? what's great about that? It's because you know what you're doing from both sides because you you were in IT for so long. Yes, so I, I, <laughs> you are exactly right. I've worked in IT for the last 30 years uh, as a senior consultant, um, building um, systems for major corporations around the U.S. and part of Europe. And I'm now focusing my energy and all my time helping local businesses succeed with what I've learned over the past 30 years. Well... I would think I'll stand up for local businesses and say, thank you, Clarence, because a lot have gone through a lot over the past year. And that's so true. Yes. Yes. And so can you explain a little bit more uh, what your business does to help a local business and who you serve? So right now, over the past three years, Karen, we focus on businesses like um, spars, gyms, auto repair shops, car wash, and we've added a new category within the last year is churches. Um, I'll speak to what we specifically do with the spars, the gyms, and I'll give you an example of what we did with the church, for example. So local spars have clientele that they consistently market to. Once they get these in their business, they don't have a consistent way of bringing them back. So we've developed a system over the year that we help them market to these people with coupons or with um, Facebook ad. Once they get them in store, we help them or show them how to get these people to join the VIP club. And our system consistently send out reminders or a birthday or an anniversary a coupon to get those people to come back in consistently. And the goal for doing this, Karen, is, uh, as you know, in marketing, we spend more marketing dollars getting new customers instead of maintaining the ones that we currently have. It's easier to maintain those ones and our system helps local businesses reach out to their current client through the database that they've built over the years. I love that because client retention is such a big deal. It is. And yeah, because you, I even say when I uh, welcome new clients to Mojo that it's wonderful that they invested money with us but we want to make sure to retain them. And so we give them all the training they need right. for them to execute. So speak a little bit more about what you're doing. So um, like I said, our system help, let's take, for example, a local spa. They want to attract new clients. So we build out a campaign on social media, be it Facebook, Instagram, or just generally uh, on their webpage that we offer something to a new client that client sees it, clicks on the link. We are able to present them with what we call a redeemable coupon online or smart coupon online that brings them in the door. Once they get in the door, we capture their information and the business now has a, a record in the system that they can remarket to this company. Uh, and we have grown quite efficient at doing this. And we see a lot of business coming to us for our expertise to help them use our system that we have developed. Um, when we spoke earlier, I spoke about a local church. That might seem a little bit out of place, but churches do need people to come in the door and yeah. they do need to send reminders. So our system is re robust enough to advertise for 
local churches on social media, which is a big thing now, give them tidbits, information, word of knowledge. People receive it. They fill in their information, um, come into the local church, and the local church can then keep sending them text message or email message, which is one of the um, difference with our system. Most systems are just text message based, but our system, we can do both email, we can do um, um, text messaging, we can do two-way text messaging. It's pretty robust and it's gaining a lot of traction in our local area and we're hoping to expand beyond the DC metro area. Well, thank you, Clarence. And having been an associate pastor at a mega church, <laughs> I wow. will say, I agree 100%. Um, it's not, you know, we, we don't like to say it's sales, but in a way, it's remembering, remembering to come. And I, I yes. love that you're doing that. And you have a real passion for this. Why did you switch from what you have said, being almost, I would say, an international consultant yes. to focusing on small business owners. Well, um, my passion has always been, if we can use one word, helping. I looked at my IT career as doing that. I was known in the industry as the one who put out fire. So I would get called into major companies to help them solve a major IT problem. Now, having done that for a lot of years, I said, well, um, it's gets kind of old over time traveling from one state to the other and I'm traveling from one country to the other. So what next can I do? And then this pandemic came in and local business were struggling. So I just said, well, I think it's time for me to leave this traveling and stay focused, help local business become more successful get a better return on their investment. See, most local businesses don't have the expertise in-house for their marketing. And with someone with my ability and my background, having that, they don't have to spend X amount of dollars to bring me in as an employee, but they can hire my company to become an extension of their business to help them succeed. I think you put that really well, Clarence. And if someone wants to reach you, what is the best way to do so? Um, the best way is you can go to our website, um, www.infinitymediagroup.com, fill out the contact form, or you click on the uh, um, free consultation form. We'll be glad to talk to any business out there that needs help in the marketing, or you can give us a call, 1-800-277-7398. Thank you so much for being on today, Clarence. Thank you, Karen. It was a pleasure. It was a pleasure. And I want to thank you for listening to our audience. And we'll be back next time with another amazing Mojo client. Take care.